So the uh, little intro here, uh, I've tested it now, the uh, Pop Voice dual lavalier mic with the Alcatel, obviously I did that, I shot that video, the unboxing, etc. on the Alcatel using open camera, so I could select an external mic, and uh, then again on the... Uh, Last night, I shot it on the new mobile G3, and then today, I shot it on the, uh, shot a little bit using this phone, the Axon M. Make sure you check the description below for links to all these products and some info on them. Uh, let's get right to the intro, and then we'll get to the new G3 video and then we'll move on and I'll be back talking because we are filming on the Axon M as usual. Hi right, folks, uh, we have a uh, Pop Voice dual mic plugged into the Mobile G3 straight to the dongle. We're going to check it that way. First, I'm going to tap my mic. You should hear thumping. And then we should hear thumping from this one that we're going to play the music off of. Making sure both mics work. Let's play some tunes right now. Okay, so that should be that. Let's see what we got. Okay, the final conclusions on that is the mic picks up from both channels. Now, I had the UNS turned up maybe 30%, and of course the mic is point blank, and I'm not talking that loud. I was not able to talk over it, but... Uh, Obviously, if you're just going from one source to another to show people, fairly easy, just shut the hell up while you do the other source. Uh, so I would call this a success. So, the last phone we tried this with, the G3 worked, obviously. Worked fine, did its job. The last phone I tried it with tonight was the phone we're taping on, filming on, creating on. Call it what you want. Um, unfortunately, you can't select an external mic. Even though you can plug it in, you'll see a headset appear. You ain't getting crap out. <laughs> Not gonna happen. That's just... The way it is. Um, I tried coming in through a USB-C and a splitter like I do on the G3. <laughs> Not on the Axon app. I put open camera on it so I could look, you know, for the external mic. Open camera and this phone don't get along at all. No happen. You can get those rotation programs and try to force it. Doesn't happen. It wants to shoot everything upside down. And uh, that looked look kind of damn silly, wouldn't it? Uh, the external mics will work then. <laughs> but I'm not going to redo a whole video and try to invert it and rotate it. So... Open camera and the Axon M. They're not friends. 
Well, that's probably due to the fact of the multiple screens and the app not being optimized. And how many foldable phones are out there? Okay. So, bottom line here, though, is my final conclusions. Here they are. This, if you have a regular one-screen phone, is totally worth your money. It'll work. You're going to have to probably put open camera on it. That is not the fault of the microphone maker. That is the fault of Google and their freaking Android app, which the other stock camera apps don't lie to just hit, oh, pick an external mic. Doesn't happen. In fact, in, except in one case I know of, the Mi A2 uh, from Xiaomi, uh, which is a, a budget phone and still one hell of a value out there. Uh, it at least allows you to choose the format so you can pick MP4. Now the Axon here shoots an MP4 box stock. So I'm thinking, well, I would just plug the mic in. Because I know some of the Samsungs, uh, as I understand it, some of the Apples, especially the ones that use the dongle and blah, 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 uh, will work uh, with an external mic quite easily. The difference between high quality uh, optimizations of camera apps and just hi it takes pictures it's got AI it's wonderful oh look it's got zooming lenses and telephoto uh, it's wonderful oh I can't use an external mic hello now this will work with a sound recorder on the Axon M but if you're buying the Axon M for more than just the wow factor, and the fact it's a good, excellent uh, phone for the price of, if you're buying it just so you can use it to, I don't know, do interviews, uh, I don't know. You're not going to be able to use this mic to do that. Other than that, two super inexpensive budget phones, one from T-Mobile, the Alcatel 7, and one from either us.newmobile.com or Amazon. Uh, also super cheap. They will use uh, open camera and they will allow you to choose the external mic. And open camera will shoot and M MPEG-4, MP-4, whatever you want to call it. So my final conclusion is this is a definite buy. It's worth your money unless you have a foldable phone. In which case, uh, oops. Oh, wait, never mind. The foldable phone already has a kick-ass microphone that we're using right now better than any phone i've ever used so all that being said if you found this informative helpful remotely entertaining or just interesting give us a big thumbs up and then uh, it'll be coming up here shortly make sure you hit the subscribe button and then that little bell, it's, it's right on the screen there when you're in YouTube. Uh, there's subscribe and get notified. I do this both. That way you'll know when we put out a new video. You don't have to watch them. But it's cool to be a subscriber and I appreciate every single person who watches these videos. So, on that note, we're going to cut it off right there. 
we're gonna go and do the uh, the outro whatever you want to call it now throw a couple of videos up in the corner for you to watch thanks catch you in the next one